Welcome back into Wake Up America. Uh, more information keeps coming to light finally about Hunter Biden and his main business partner at Rosemont Seneca, Eric Sherwin, who visited the White House, as we now know, at least 27 times while Joe Biden was vice president. And now we're learning more about Hunter's ties to a Russian oligarch, one of 45, that conveniently has yet to be sanctioned. Yeah, our next guest has done extensive reporting on Hunter Biden. Joining us now is investigative journalist Vicki Ward. Good morning, Vicki. Good morning. Vicki, in your latest article for Substack, you write about an oligarch with Hunter Biden connections that has avoided the sanction list. So to steal your words, does someone have some explaining to do? <laughs> I think they do. In fact, I can tell you, um, as of an hour ago, uh, somebody from Systema, the company that is run by the Russian oligarch, uh, Vladimir Yevtushenkov, confirmed that their meeting with Hunter Biden did take place in 2012 when he was on a business trip to New York. Uh, Yevtushenkov is a mega investor. He's Russia's biggest diversified investor. He met with uh, very important CEOs. And then rather oddly, he had a breakfast with Hunter Biden at the Ritz-Carlton Hotel mm. in New York. He then went on to have a meeting according to his schedule with a company that Hunter Biden was on the board for, was consulting for at Rosemont Realty. That meeting was not scheduled at Rosemont Realty's headquarters in New Mexico. It was scheduled at a satellite office in Dallas, Texas. The then CEO of Rosemont Realty knew nothing about any meeting. So there are big questions, both about that, which I am asking Sustema about as we speak, and um, about why Yevtushenkov uh, is not on the sanctions list. Yevtushenkov, right. we also know, um, has had business dealings in real estate with Elena Baturina, the wife of the former mayor of Moscow, right. who it's been reported recently wired $3.5 million two years later after this meeting in 2014 to another Hunter Biden and Devon Archer company, uh, Rosemont Seneca Thornton. And there are questions as to what that money was for. Obviously, Devon Archer is currently serving or about to go to prison for uh, right, uh, right. bond fraud. Hunter Biden uh, has not been accused of wrongdoing, but remains under investigation for money laundering tax problems. Of course. Mm -hmm. and, and Vicky, we do think that we've had several people on the program say that that he could face very serious charges, um, which would have very serious implications for Joe Biden. But I just for everybody watching at home, these Russian names are so confusing um, just because they're not you know, we're not used to hearing these names every day. But can you just explain it to us? Um, it, sort of make the connection because right there, the mayor of Moscow, that's an easy connection for me to make. But make yes. the connection to Vladimir Putin himself. Right. So uh, Yevtushenkov, being this uh, huge uh, diversified, the biggest diversified investor in Russia, is someone who knows Putin extremely well. There was a fallout at one point over competing oil interests. And in 2014, Yevtushenkov was placed under house arrest. But since then, he sold his oil company. And he and Putin have made up. And in fact, even spent the night together, I report, uh, looking at a, 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 a military facility in Siberia. There was a snowstorm. They were trapped together. They spent the night yeah. on mm. cop in the same room. Until very, very recently, this man, Yevtushenkov, owned uh, a majority holding an RTI, which provides mm. the Russian military yeah. with... Uh, GLONASS, the Russian GPS system, and it provides the, it provides the technology to uh, basically guide the missiles. Mm -hmm. Vicky, and we, the drone, unfortunately, the drone. Vicky Ward, Ward, we're out of time. Um, I'm so sorry to, to cut you off, but great reporting and please come back and see yes. us, Vicky. I've enjoyed your reporting for a long time, yes. dating back to Jeffrey Epstein. But please Thank come back you. and see us. This story is not going away. Thank you, Vicky. Thank you. Hey, I'm Rob Finnerty. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please join the conversation in the comments below. Don't forget to subscribe, too. Hit the bell icon to be alerted to breaking news. And remember, there's a whole lot more on Newsmax TV, America's fastest growing cable news network. Newsmax TV, where real news for real people.